So I want to give you a little glimpse of some of the action that's going on inside of this footing. So currently what you're seeing on top is a grid of rebar that is spaced approximately in 12 by 12 squares. This rebar is number four, which means that after you get past number three, that's three eighths in diameter, this is four eighths or half an inch. Once you get up to number four or higher, you're actually going to start getting some strength from the rebar itself in your concrete rather than just crack reduction from the rebar. So the rebar is in place, it's tied to the rebar in the footings, which is a little bit larger. In this case, it's number five. And we have stirrups every 24 inches. And what this is doing is this is giving us strength inside of our beams. What you see here is a rebar grid over a waffle style beam structure in the concrete. This rebar does two things. One, it, it supports with strength, and two, it's going to help reduce expansion and contraction on the slab itself, helping the slab to stay together and reduce any kind of structural cracking.